All right. All right. So um, the first one, uh, the site keeps logging out. Um, so uh, I don't know how to demonstrate that um, because it happens maybe over a course of a day, maybe a course over maybe a couple of hours. I don't know. But after a while, it'll log people out and you got to log back in. So wherever you have to go to basically have them be logged in forever or logged in for 100 years or however you want to need to do it. I just need to make sure they never get logged out. All right. So the first thing I'm going to explain to you also is um, you see that in the bottom right corner, uh, my serenity social, you know, the black icon with the hands. Um, that's a, a PWA. When you go on the back end, you will see that it's a PWA, a, pro a progressive web app. And basically it uh, downloads, it doesn't download an app. It's not an app. It basically turns what would be an add to home screen link and make it operate like an app in its own window using Safari or wherever you downloaded it from, where I did it from Safari. Let me see. Uh, so if you look at it and it's, it says my my serenity social, that's actually just Safari. I think it's Safari. I don't know, but it's not an app. OK, so everything I do, I'm going to click on this. Everything I do on this basically works on the Safari version of the website because it's basically, from my understanding, um, just taking a, a web page and providing a link to the home screen but making it look like an app it's basically a link that looks like an app and then when it opens up in its own web page it makes it look like an app at the top it generally operates like an app but it's still a website right it, you know everything that the website does this thing does but i probably just go use the website so issue uh so again issue number one um i don't know how to demonstrate that because i think that happens over time maybe like i said over a, a course of a couple hours when people get logged out but issue number two i'm gonna use my test profile and hopefully oh lord i gotta put them you gotta see my profile anyway so i'm gonna click log in and I, and find out why i also find out why why does it make me log in twice you know i don't understand why it makes me log in twice um if you if you can fix that issue I, I just noticed that issue um i'm gonna write that down uh log in twice uh, twice yeah uh, i want to get rid of that issue as well um if you need you know a couple more dollars to to do that issue or you need a little bit more money to fix that issue Go ahead and uh, let me know, and I'll add it to a, as a bonus or something. But again, let's go. Oh, automatically remembers me. Oh. Stop, 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 stop. All right, it doesn't do it. Anyway, whatever. All right, we're about to log in. Why are you not logging in? You log in literally every other time. Hello? Log in? No. What are you doing? Just... Log in. What are you doing? So why? Oh my God! This is more problems after more problems, man. Damn. Um. Um. So if you can solve that issue, why it didn't log me in that very first time I tried to log in? You know what is going on with that? I wish this stuff would just work. Um. But yeah, so it logs me into the back end. This is not an admin page, but it's it's revealing a way too much. I don't want people to know I'm using WordPress at all. I don't want them to go to the back end page. So 
just redirect them to the act. Is that right? <sighs> my God, my God, my God, my God! Why don't this thing just work? Yeah. So, why is it loading the web page? Just do it. So, I mean, I don't know what's going on. It's not loading. Of course, it's not loading. But anyway, re redirect them to the act activity page. Um, and just redirect them to the activity page. This one here on the left, redirect them to the activity page. Now, if I go on here. Is it because of this? Hold on, just... I'm sorry. I'm sorry it's this long, but I mean, it's just not doing anything. But it loads it right here. So it loads it on the PWA, but it doesn't load it on, load it on Safari. So, I mean, find out, you know, why that's an issue. I mean, I didn't want to add these issues to the job, but things pop up all the time. But anyway, yeah, find out why it's doing this. Um, and the other thing, um, again, let's log out. Get the hell out of my way. So log in. And it takes you to the back end page. Do this one more time. Log in. Log in. So it makes me log in twice or it doesn't allow me to log in here. So I don't, I don't understand what's going on. I want them to log in. I just want the login to work, but it's bringing me to the back end page. So that's issue number two. Let's get to issue number three. Uh, let's go to groups. And groups. And forum. So we're making a new forum topic and see notify me. I want that automatically checked. I don't know how that's going to work, but um, yeah, when they, when they do a, 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 um, a new forum post, I want that automatically checked. Um, yeah. So I want that automatically checked right there. All right. The help a friend tab, which is confusing. I think you have to do it. Let's try it like this. So help a friend. This is somebody's profile. So this is not my profile. This is me looking at another user's profile. And it has. Okay. No, it doesn't. It's somewhere in here. It's hidden away somewhere in here. Maybe it's here. So now this is my profile. But it's my profile and my timeline. Right. So forget invitations. I don't want that. I'm not using that. Yeah, this is like uh, something simple. I don't like it. Um, <laughs> I'm going to get rid of that. So profile. And this help a friend tab at the bottom. Just go ahead and put it right here. Beside blog. Right there. See what icon they're using. I don't know if I use that icon. 
I'm probably going to need a different icon. Mm. So uh, anyway, that help friend tab, remove it from there and put it over here. Um, right, right under people, but use a different icon if you can find one. Um, you know, something that resembles helping a friend or something friendly or something like that. Um, but put it beside blog under people. I'm just gonna keep it for there for now. When my um, I might move it later, but I'm gonna keep it for there. Keep it there for now. I'm gonna skip to number six because I'm already logged in. I'm gonna go to the blog. Uh, important message from founder and you see above important message it says buy i added a plugin to remove um because that's i can only post um i post it on my admin my actual actual admin page um but i don't want people to know the username of my admin because i don't want them trying to log in because later on i'm gonna add you know, I did have two-factor authentic authentication, STA, but I took that off so you guys can log in without a headache. Um, also, I have WP Admin as as my admin, but it was something else, you know, more obscure, more confusing, just random letters and numbers. So, again, hackers won't get to my admin, but which is kind of pointless because you can get to my admin from just hitting the login button, but, you know. Why not do it? But I don't want people to know my actual admin page. I have a faux or dummy or a fake admin page that's just a subscriber, has subscriber uh, permissions. That um, That's something that's fake. It's just a dummy to distract or, you know, if hackers try to hack, you, you know, use the admin, you know, they, they get redirected to a fake dummy page with no permissions. But anyway, um, so again, remove that by, just remove it out the way. Just have it completely gone. I don't want my username, date, nothing to be um, be be visible. All right, so I'm gonna log back out and I'm gonna do point number five. At point number five, I must. Let me use this. No, I can't do that. So point number five, let's go back out. We're going to log out. Create an account. And you do your usual um, username and all that. This right here, is it? Is that required? Hold on. So um, it did have it as a requirement, um, but it's removed because I tried to remove it as a requirement. But um, if it's because I had somebody, um, I create a custom uh, mobile field that wasn't used or somehow he did it with code or something like that. But I wanted the mobile field to go to an app that I don't use anymore. I mean, to a, a plugin that I don't use anymore that is uh, that takes down uh, phone numbers and sends SMS messages. I think it's called like SMS Pro or something like that. But I don't use that anymore. And um, I tried to remove uh, the mobile as a requirement. It didn't do it before. It looks like it's, it's doing it now. Let, let me test it out. See if I can sign up. Oh, so it did it. So it looked like it did it already. So I guess that one's done already. Um, yeah, okay. 
So it looks, that one's done already. But the other one, for whatever reason, is making me log in twice. It's, so I can't, let me go back to, so let me try this again. So see how it didn't log me in? For whatever reason, it didn't log me in. Fix that issue. Um, since the uh, phone number requirement is already fixed, um, notify me. When... Matter of fact, um, for the phone number requirement, put optional. Somehow have it say optional. I want people to know it's optional. I don't so so make it optional um, because it was a requirement and you couldn't create a profile without uh, a phone number being a requirement. So make it optional. But um, why is it uh, having me log in twice? It didn't allow me to log in and it was loading. Let me try this. So. And again, sends it to the back end. Um, we go to the activity page, personal. Maybe it'll do it this time. All right, so I, I don't know. Seems fixed now. Oh, yeah, so it's doing this lo loading. Yeah, so when I hit, yeah, so it's loading, loading, loading. Please wait, please wait. This is on the website um, version of Safari, you know, Make sure, make sure all this works on Chrome as well. But when I click activities right here, it's just doing this loading. So, you know, if you can fix that issue as well, on top of the fact that it didn't let me log in, if you want to charge more money, a little bit more money, you know, I'll do it in a bonus or you, you'll just let me know how much you'll charge extra for that. Um, and I think that should be it.